Hello YouTube, welcome to my channel. Previously I have created a login form which means the user provided data with database and displays whether the login credentials are valid or not. And today I will show you whether the text field and password field in the login form are empty or not. So if user do not provide login credentials and directly clicks on sign in button, it matches with the database value and shows the message is username and password not correct. So, in today's tutorial, I will show you without typing any data, it should display message as username and password field is empty when user click on sign in button. So for that, let me place two level for displaying the message as username and password field is empty. So this is for username, let me remove the text and change its variable name also, let it be level underscore username and for password remove the text and change its variable name label underscore password so now double click on the sign in button to write the code to check whether it is empty or not so you have to right before the type try key as block so let me see what is the name of our text field and password field it is username and it is password so let me begin the coding if username that is our text field name dot dot get text dot stream dot if it is empty and there is another field also password field let me check for both for the first time password means our password field name dot get text dot stream this both are empty then what we have to do is we have to display message a in the level is username is empty and password is empty so for that level underscore username is our level name the set text in this one and provide user name is empty so this will display the message username is empty and also for password when password field is empty password dot set text password is empty then after so this will check only when both fields are empty so if user name is only empty, I have to write the code for that also. So else if let me copy this from here up to empty till what then after what message I should display is when username is empty, I should display message in label underscore username that username is empty. Similarly for password also. Let me copy the code that I have written earlier and paste it here for password. Then I have to, I have to display this message label in label underscore password that password is empty. So if both fill are not empty, then what I have to do is I have to check it with the database value. So else statement will run here so let me show you by running the code when I directly click on sign button it will display messages username is empty and password is empty so when I provide database value then it will check now 
username and password is not correct but the lib the message in the label is still in the window so when user type some data it should go away from here so for that let me write the code so click uh, click on design then after right click on the text field then after go to events and go to key and click on key released when the key is released the message should be removed from the label so for that label underscore username dot set text it should be empty when the key is released the text should be the text field should be empty then after for password also right click on the password field go to events and go to key and key click on key released then I have to write down here label underscore name of our label is password password dot set text let it be empty so let me show you by running it once username is empty and password is empty let me provide username so the Label message in the label is removed, and when I provide some password, the the message in the label is removed again. Let me click on sign in button. So it is not correct. So by this you can perform the coding yourself. This much for today, and thanks for watching. Please like the video and subscribe my channel. Thank you.